My name is Andre Brown. I'm a computer programmer by trade and I'm an artist by passion. Hi, I am the Dion Victoria. I'm an artist and educator and entrepreneur. So we are learning the elements of art and the principles of design. You have color, you have lines, you have like negative space or space here. I use like a little, little bit of perspective. Color, definitely. Texture's definitely a big one here because there's a lot going on. We're allowing them to experience expressive drawing, expressive art. When I paint, I paint kind of my feeling, like my expressions. And we're also giving them some guided instructions as far as creating portraits. I'm a portrait artist, so here's some examples of the type of portraits I have done. And we made sure to look at different examples of portraits. So when students created their own portraits, they knew it didn't necessarily have to be photorealistic. And it didn't necessarily even have to look like a person, but it could be however you want to create yourself. So this is going to start your portfolio Hello. where you all can keep your artwork. We're going to make sure you have it. So a long time from now, we'll make sure we preserve it. And when you come back to see it and you remember, hey, I did that art. The older kids are building portfolios while the younger kids are learning about local artists, both living and not living and applying it to art making. We want to look at Faith Ringo. We're looking at Candace Hunter, a collage artist, a painter, and an installation artist. When they were looking at Candace Hunter, our first and second graders were taking the time to create um, collages. And it was just this one? really, really creative the way the students, they all kind of came up with their own ideas from the inspiration of the collages. This is my third time doing a residency here, and every time I feel welcomed and a part of the community. The kids are always excited to learn, and then everybody just working in harmony. We look forward to continuing spreading um, love using art and uh, educating the communities that we serve, uh, not only here in Akiva, which is an amazing place, but throughout the world.